back to Lefty these two broadcasts. We are at week 27 in the books, and we're going right in Lefty's these two chill. Did not have a chill week this week. They had about 10 people leave, not show up, miss games left and right, and it showed. They get fourth place, Team Japan, Sons of Pitches, White Sox. Fifth place was the American. Another goal level five. Left these two chill about three weeks in a row with the W. That's nice indeed. About three or four missed games. Not too bad. Not too bad. Pirates handling their business in their goal level five bracket. Followed by the All-Stars, ML USA, MLB, team from Japan and South Korea. That's going to be the game of the day. Little spoiler alert. Uh, your guy from the Pirates is going to be there. De La Rosa. Anyways, goal level five matchup. The Padres handled their bracket handily. Handily, followed by Redditors. Righties, 777 in Quebec Baseball League of Canada. All right, Silver League 2, Bambinos. Guys, if you're looking for a club, jump on the Bambinos. They're up and coming. Handling it, handling it, still growing. Okay, goal level five here, Mighty Sandbaggers of Sandbagville. Still just playing at a high level against trash opponents. Great job, guys. Way to show the world you guys are great. And followed by the Gold Moon, right? Taiwan is smoking bunts in another Taiwan team. All right, Mandalorians, 209. They are doing their thing as well. Met Seven Line Army. And followed by the Taiwan team, Japan and MLB. The big drummers, or the big dumpsters, whatever you want to call them, the big dumps. They handle a second place, excuse me, Team Korea, 199 there. It was pretty much a battle for third. Thrashers making it with Team Japan and Trigger Jays in fourth place. Gold level two, BOW, another club. If you guys are looking for a club that's up and coming, BWO, Baseball World Order, jump on, right? They are up and coming, handling it again weeks and weeks in a row. Another goal level two you might want to jump on, Thin Blue Line. I think the Mariners, man. The Mariners were top 100 team for a while. They are falling out, falling out. Wrong direction for the Mariners, all right? And Snow Cats and Poetry, handling it, all right? No contest in this bracket. All right, not exactly what you want to see, but the Rockets, first place. Again, if you guys miss the opportunity, show this page. I don't really care, all right? Still shows where you're at. Good job, Rockets, followed by the Orioles, Cooperstown, and so on and so forth. And the Little Dumpsters, the Little Dumpers. Taking a little dump, but hey, they get their ward in the bronze level three match. That's all you got to do is get the W. And we are going to that game of the day. Here we go. We got da -da -da -da, Mandalorians, Chen versus De La Rosa of the Pirates. Of the Roses for you non-Spanish speakers. Okay, it's a long one, so you guys got to buckle in. This is a good game. A lot of time to talk. If you want your club match to be in it, guys, post a video in the Clash video group page. I'll just download it from there if you, you know, want to. Or you can send me a Google link. It's up to you how you want it done. But all right. Again, if you guys pay attention, Chen or his other account, he just wins every single time. So someone, challenge him to a game. All right, just challenge him to a game. See, uh, kind of, maybe he can get a loss one day so he can stop posting all his winning videos. It's not all that fun. Anyway, let's get back to the game. Enough of me ranting along and a little exhausted. Okay, easy, easy inning there. Got the double play. Uh, De La Rosa getting a little angry. Chin, uh, De La Rosa leading off with Smith. Uh, excuse me, that's De La Rosa leading off with Smith. Did I say that? I don't know. It's a long day, long morning because of a long night. James, again, for you guys out there that are trying to complain, I mean, you guys are complaining about, yo, man, how hard is it? I always keep on going against these level 13 pitchers. Here's a thought. Get your pitcher to level 13. Stop using a whole bunch of legendary cards at level 10. Get your common cards, James, Eric, right? Michelle, get one of them to 13 as fast as possible. Just plug away. Once you get that pitcher, 
That's going to help you, right? The idea is not to let the other team score runs. Right? If you can get a good pitcher, it's going to make it easier. And again, if you're a decent hitter, your lower level hitters, well, they'll bloop some in, get a little little line drive somewhere. You might win some more games. But you got to stop complaining. This game's been out for more than two years, people. A lot of people have been playing for that long when there was less cards. They remember, there's playing. I played this game when there was like 30 cards or 40 cards. It's easy. You know, once you get higher maxed out cards, it becomes a little easier because you just get a lot of gold. If you're new to the game, it's a disadvantage. That's the idea of paying money. If you don't come in early, it makes it much more difficult. Look at the stock market, right? Get in early, get rich. Get in late, it's going to be a long haul. All right. De La Rosa has a chance to walk it off here in the bottom of the 10th inning. Got Ruth on. Kevin took the bad one swing in the back and get it out of here. And he's going to steal. Gets in there safe and sound. Got a runner in scoring position now. Now a little blooper can pretty much do it for him. Okay. And... Again, really good batter discipline there. Good eye of the strike zone. Again, for all you people out there that keep on talking about people that don't throw strikes, look at this game. Right? Just look at the game. Chen here is pitching on the edges, making him chase. But De La Rosa is doing something, not swinging. Well, he swung at that one. That was close. That's what happens. You make it close, get better eyesight. This game is hard enough. And let's take out Chin here using the manual bat, getting a good sense of the strike zone. You're going to see him move the cursor here pretty soon. A little bit, a little bit. You do that to kind of get your thumb a little bit loose, but also you're going to start getting a little bored but checking the edges of the strike zone. And he swings out of there. Got to have good discipline. But here we go, top of the 10th inning, right? It's, anything can happen. Got Ruth there at second base. Alexandra pops up. Two outs. Quick outs. De La Rosa using Eric. Right? Level 13 Eric. Got that solid cutter. Inside. Got a little hit and run action to win the game. Not happening. We're going to the bottom of the tent. This is brought to you by a Taiwan NBA YouTube update. Check out your NBA offseason. Where is Damian Lillard going? Who knows? All right. So, De La Rosa up to bat with Michael. Again, for you new players out there, Michael is a stud. Get him as high as possible. He will help. All right. Bases loaded. Easy walk off. No outs, right? Here it comes. De La Rosa has a chance to show up Chen and win the game the easy way. Kevin, a lot of slow people on... Score. Here we go. Uh, this is what you want to see. Swinging right through it, way ahead. Again, I don't like this at her batting stance, man. Way too much like Kevin Euclid. At least she doesn't look like Kevin Euclid. But with the easy strikeout, one out. Oh, line drive, swinging at a ball. Got to be better than that, Matthew. And a little dribbler. 98. What level does he have Matthew at? I didn't even see that. That's a that's a downer. That can come back and haunt you. All right, we're going to extra baseball. Top of the 11th inning. Get back. Alexandra. And Gina, the little speedster. And inside, inside, inside. Nice pitch. Using that little extra Matthew shot right there. Going up high. That's great pitching. Great placement. Ooh, leaving it up there. Almost got her. Way late on that. Just staying alive. Uh, okay, little blooper. Going three. All right, the bases are full of ladies. And another lady's coming right up there to see if she can get the job done. Get that possible winning run in. Jessica. Go for a squeeze. Oh, man. That is interesting. You got to get that. Man, you got to get that runner out at first. But that squeeze play, that's dangerous with no outs. It's an easy force out. 
Hoping to get the ball a little bit further out, but not too much. James pops it up. Inside pitch. And what do you got to do? Oh, little taunting. De La Rosa with the taunt. And that's what you get. Michael comes through in the clutch with a little blooper. You got to get back. Swipe. It's just in there. Okay. Ruth. The Ruth. The Ruth is on fire. Let's see if he can stretch the lead out here. Bases loaded. Two outs. Uh, two strikes here in the top of the 11th inning. And he goes in. Strike three. Good job using the inside-outside approach. Got a little too much ahead of himself. All right, James coming in to close it out. Speaking of that, we're about to have a new club league. We're gonna, the update is coming up pretty soon. We're going to have some substitutions. This is going to be very interesting with the beta test. Looking quite forward to it. And Smith to the window, to the wall. Coming down. Matthew, oh my God, 98 speed. That is not the best strategy. Oh, you got to hit the wall. You can't even score. And oh, he's got to get it. Wow. Uh, it seemed a little bit slow for Fox. That could have been it. Bases, runners in scoring position, pop up. Okay. Getting out, two outs now. He had bases loaded, no outs. Potential walk-off. But, mm, I mean, here we go. Kevin, oh, so dangerous, Kevin. Good eye, good eye. James, chin. Give a little sweet chin music. And being very careful. Not letting Kevin beat him. Slides in a strike. Back door. Slider going back door again. No chase. Good eye, De La Rosa. All right. Kevin, up to bat. Excuse me, Gibson. Batting 383 with Gibson. I really think you're probably using automatic batting. You can't be batting 383 with Gibson and have that. Either way, we're going to the final stretch. Baseball, 12 innings. Fastball hitter out. At, that doesn't matter. I'm surprised right here. You could just send Michael and then keep going to Gibson. Good job. Good job not to get the cheap run by Chin. He is a crafty guy in the base paths. Kevin's up to bat. The oh so dangerous Kevin. And, look, and again, De La Rosa's being extra careful. Not giving in anything to hit. Just four straight balls. You know what? They should have a, an intentional walk button. Right? Just get the, give them the four. No need to waste the pitches. This intentional walk button, mini clip. Guys, write it in. Intentional walk for Kevin if you want. But again, dangerous. Dangerous strategy. Right? You're gonna walk Kevin with the bases loaded. That's why you have Alexander there. But she did not come through in the clutch. Good pitching by De La Rosa. Getting a dangerous hitter out. Christina's up. Had some power in her. Not quite that. Oh, this is overpowering. Swinging at balls. Get you every time. Going back inside. All right. Looking for that outside pitch here, probably. Going outside. Yes, indeed. Move the eyes around. Michael. Last hope for De La Rosa. Bottom of the 12th. Tied 1-1. Gets the dribbler. Goes one. Two outs. Oh, wow. Just like that. And Kevin Euclid is up to bat once again. Going inside. Da -da 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 -da. Inside. One one count. Runner on third. Outside. Inside. Outside. Using the sliders. Using that movement. Off speed. Two two. Oh boy. Here we go. Just a little blooper. Get the walk off in. Swinging at ball three. First game and left these two broadcasts that ends in a tie. Man, it's like kissing your sister. Chen from Mandalorians. Ties. Pirates. De La Rosa. Let's go to the game. Top. See that? Oh, man, I am just out of it. Long video. All right, before we go to the top 100, let's look. little update. Three days, 26. Three days. About four days away. So we're going to have the beta test in the middle. Right? 
There you go. Give you one. Okay. New top 100. Here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 30, 40, 26 teams at 4,000. All right. The Pirates are on the edge. De La Rosa. You get those Pirates. The Jolly Rogers. One solid week here. He has it. Back up there. Tied in the 4,000. Unless that beta test changes things. I'm not sure. But here we go. Left these two chill. Hanging in the 30. Slowly, but slowly, but slowly, but surely. Getting to that 4,000. One of these teams here has a really solid week. This Japanese team, I think. They get a really good solid week. They might have a chance. That first place. Big dumpers making their move. Again, let's see. Moderated names. Smoking bunts. Again, goal level five. Taking up the top 100. And we, how many teams are in the top 100 with goal level five? Yeah, we got 79 teams now in goal level five. Brackets, man. What are they going to do? They got to go higher. They got to go platinum club or something now. All right, goal level four, smoking aces. Nexus is there still. Holy smokes. All right, and final all stars. Got to keep climbing. There it is, the hounds. Where are they from? They're from everywhere. The Hounds, right there. Gold level four. No more gold level threes. It's it's going to be pretty, in about two or three weeks, it's going to be all gold level fives all the time. Either way, see you guys on another Let These Two broadcast. See you next time.